Beloved brothers and sisters of Home Moravian Church, what is next for worship? As North Carolina gradually lifts its restrictions on gatherings, this question is very much on the minds of all our members. And the Board of Elders is engaged in an ongoing discussion of whether and when and how to resume in-person gatherings for worship. Helping us in our discernment is Brother Keith Steyerwalt, who is a medical professional. He serves as the Program Director of Faith Health Clinical Medicine at Wake Forest Baptist Health, and he brings a public health perspective to our discussion. He is also a member of our home church safety ministry team, and he has agreed to be our point person in the congregation for questions about COVID-19. Last Thursday, the board met to consider the possibility of outdoor worship, which is allowed by Governor Cooper's Executive Order 138. The discussion was guided not only by practical considerations, but more deeply by our community's values, to care for one another, especially the most vulnerable, to limit suffering, and as it says in 1 Corinthians 16, 14, to let all that we do be done in love. The meeting ended with a discussion not to move forward with any in-person Sunday services at this time. Now, of course, we do look forward with hope to a time when it seems right to begin our gatherings again. And when that time comes, we will move slowly and cautiously, and our gatherings will look different with stricter protocols in place for things like distancing and disinfecting and covering our faces. These protocols are being developed now by our safety ministry team and will be in place before our first in-person gathering. Now you've probably heard that last Saturday a federal court handed down a decision that will allow North Carolina churches to gather as congregations outdoors or in with no limitations on numbers as long as guidelines for distancing can be followed. Now this is what we may do. We have permission. But it is not what we must do. We have a choice. And the judge in this case wrote, the court trusts worshipers and their leaders to look after one another and society. The Home Church Board of Elders is united in our commitment to look after one another and society. And for this reason, the Home Church Elders ask that the congregation continue to worship at home, physically separated, together in heart. We look after one another and the larger society by caring for the health of all. We pray diligently for our world, for our country, for our leaders, and for one another. Let us pray now. Lord Jesus, great physician, we call on your power to heal the world in this time of trauma and loss and fear. Bring good work and income to the unemployed. Bring food to the hungry. Bring companionship to the lonely. Bring health care to those without. Bring protection to all who work in the medical field and other frontline employment. Bless all leaders of government all over the world. Give them wisdom and discernment, patience and hope to help them each day. Restore us to wholeness. And draw us into your kingdom, we pray in your name. Amen.